Hello, my Twitches. It is me, Rad Abby, and that is Rad James. Say hello. Hey. Hey. Today I'm about to tell you about Fairy Potter. Let's go. What is it? Fate, bitch. That's my stripper name. First thing we see is a Scottish lad and he's looking for his friggin' sheep. And I'm like, what does this have to do with hot, sexy magic teens? Boom, we look over. Oh, I'm a dead sheep. Ah! This is full sheep. This is full sheep, dude. And there's a big scary thing. I think it's called like a fire whatever. But get out of here, dude. So that's how we find out they're monsters. <laughs> but there's a barrier that keeps them safe. You just have to stay within it. I don't care what kind of a rebel you are. Stay within the boundaries. Okay, that's how we find out about the barriers to keep out the bad guys that eat the sheep. Let's go. <laughs> so anyway, we go to Not Hogwarts. It's a very successful group of people at Not Hogwarts. They own Benihana's and shit. Tim Standlicky from the class of 99 owns five Dunkin' Donuts. Wow. How much did you get in on one of those dunks, you think? More than we have. We find out is a whole bunch of fairies. We got a meet cute with the main girl and the hot guy. Lax Rowan, not Lindsay Lohan. Lax <laughs> bro looks like the kind of guy who wants to be called daddy like you and me hey daddy call me daddy dude call me daddy i called you daddy call me daddy daddy yeah that felt good we got a whole dorm room full of ladies with their own freaking problems next i forgot about the freaking notebook she was just like might flame power equal emotion question mark <laughs> friends. The main girl here, she has red hair, so that should automatically tell us that she's a fire fairy, but we're gonna pretend we don't know. I am the fire starter. And go through the whole journey with her about everyone's like, huh, weird that you're just so magically strong when your parents definitely aren't fairies and you don't know what's up. Maybe you're adopted. And she's like, bitch, don't tell me I'm adopted, but I did hate my real mom enough to send a streak of fire over and burn her up in bed. The usual magical concoction of people. I said <laughs> The big blonde bitch is jealous of our little red fire lady. Oh, why don't you go visit your parents who clearly don't love you or whatever that think you're in Switzerland. But wouldn't you know it? You have to go through the aforementioned barrier. Bitch goes through there. You, and then you go into a graveyard that magically brings you to California. Is that where all the weird people in California come from? Yeah, this is a documentary. She goes out where she's not supposed to go. Obviously she's gonna get chased down by, you guessed it, that sheep slaying mother the sheep slayer is not wearing the wig. Oh, no, I told you about him earlier. I'm the sheep that told you about that guy. He's back, bitch. Behind you. I'm just getting wild. Heh. <laughs> Obviously, she's like bringing one of these things back with her. Boom. In comes the headmaster. Boom. I'm busting down the door and I'm saving you and I'm killing that fire that killed all the sheep. I think that's basically what happens in that bitch. Did I miss anything? Super Soaker tells her that she's a transformer. Uh, she gets upset by that and turns into a car and drives away. <laughs> oh, there's also a random girl with, with braids, weird choice, that's like behind making all these monsters come back again. She's like, I'm a random girl with braids that showed up for a second and now I'll bring it back the monsters. That's what it was like. I also know some fairy music. I don't know if you know that about me. <laughs> Bitch. All right, everyone. I hope you like my retelling of Fairy Potter. It was freaking weird and I loved it and I'm definitely gonna watch more. So if you haven't, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. I'm Rachel Villasal. I got that Insta, that Discord, that Twitter, and don't forget to come play live with me on Twitch. So, until next time. Bye. Not.